Ever wondered how much the world of quantum physics could surprise you? Well, you're about to find out. Quantum physics, the realm of the incredibly tiny, is a cornerstone of modern science. It's a world where particles can exist in two places at once, communicate instantaneously over vast distances, and even tunnel through walls. In this video, we're going to delve into 10 fascinating facts about quantum physics. We'll explore quantum superposition, where particles can be in multiple states simultaneously, and quantum entanglement, which Einstein famously called spooky action at a distance. We'll also touch on phenomena like quantum tunneling, wave-particle duality, quantum decoherence, and the mind-boggling world of quantum computing. And that's just the beginning. We'll also look into quantum teleportation, the uncertainty principle, quantum field theory, and the many worlds interpretatio. Buckle up, it's going to be a wild ride. Let's dive into the quantum realm and start with fact number 10. At number 10, we have quantum superposition. This concept is a real mind-bender, challenging our everyday understanding of reality. In the quantum world, particles don't just exist in one state or place, they exist in all possible states at once, until observed. It's like flipping a coin and having it land on heads, tails, and spinning all at the same time. Wild, right? Now let's bring in Schrodinger's cat. This thought experiment involves a cat, a flask of poison, and a radioactive source enclosed in a box. According to quantum superposition, the cat is both alive and dead until we peek inside. Only when we observe does the cat choose a state. This mind-boggling property of quantum particles has massive implications for quantum computing and encryption, pushing the boundaries of what we thought was possible. So in the quantum world, things can exist in many places at once. Talk about multitasking. Moving on to number nine, quantum entanglement. Picture two inseparable dance partners spinning in perfect harmony no matter how far apart they are. This is the essence of quantum entanglement. In the strange world of quantum physics, two particles can become entangled, meaning their states are directly connected. Now, let's say we measure one of these entangled particles. The instant we observe it, we know the state of its partner, regardless of the distance between them. This connection is instantaneous, surpassing the speed of light. It's as if the universe instantly communicates the information from one particle to the other. Here's where it gets really interesting. This entanglement holds true no matter how far apart these particles are. Whether they're across a room or across the universe, their states remain intertwined. That's quantum entanglement for you, a dance of particles across space and time. Even Einstein called it spooky action at a distance. Now, isn't that fascinating? Yay. At number eight, we have quantum tunneling. This is not your typical tunneling. In the quantum world, particles like electrons can do the seemingly impossible. They can pass through barriers that, according to the laws of classical physics, should be impenetrable. Imagine walking into a wall and instead of getting a bruised nose, you simply appear on the other side. Quantum tunneling is based on the principle of wave-particle duality, where particles are also waves, and these waves represent the probability of a particle's location. So, there's a teeny tiny chance that an electron could be on the other side of a barrier, and voila, sometimes it is. This isn't just theoretical, it's practical too. It's the principle behind scanning tunneling microscopes and even some aspects of nuclear fusion in the sun. So, 
Next time you're stuck in traffic, just wish you could quantum tunnel your way out. Coming up at number seven, wave particle duality. This is a cornerstone of quantum physics that boggles the mind. Imagine, if you will, a world where something can be two things at once. In the quantum realm, particles like electrons and photons can exhibit the characteristics of both particles and waves. When we think of particles, we imagine tiny specks of matter. Waves, on the other hand, are disturbances that move through space like ripples on a pond. In our everyday world, these are distinct concepts, but in the quantum world, they merge into one. This duality is not just theoretical, it has been confirmed by experiments such as the famous double slit experiment. This wave particle duality challenges our conventional understanding of nature blurring the lines between what we consider matter and energy. So, particles can be both waves and particles. Sounds confusing? Welcome to quantum physics. At number six, we have quantum decoherence. This fascinating phenomenon is the bridge that connects the quantum world with the classical world we experience every day. But how does it do that? Well, it's all about the interaction between quantum systems and their environment. In a perfectly isolated quantum system, particles exist in a state of superposition, meaning they can be in multiple states at once. But when they interact with their environment, this superposition is disturbed. The quantum states decohere and the particles settle into one specific state. That's when the magic happens. That's when the bizarre, fuzzy probabilities of the quantum world collapse into the definite, tangible reality we know and love. It's like a cosmic game of musical chairs, where the music is the quantum world and the chairs are the classical states. So that's how our classical world emerges from the weirdness of the quantum world. Moving on to number five, quantum computing. Picture a computer that could process data millions of times faster than anything we have today. This is the promise of quantum computing. Rather than using bits as ones and zeros, quantum computing uses quantum bits or qubits, which can be both one and zero at the same time thanks to a phenomenon known as superposition. Imagine the possibilities when we harness this power. Complex problems that would take our current computers thousands of years to solve could be done in a matter of minutes or even seconds. This would revolutionize everything from drug discovery to climate modeling and even artificial intelligence. However, it's not all smooth sailing. Quantum computers are incredibly sensitive to their environment and need to be kept at temperatures close to absolute zero to function correctly. So, while the technology is promising, there's still work to do. Quantum computing could be the future of technology. Exciting, isn't it? At number four, we have quantum teleportation. Now, this is where things get really exciting, folks. Quantum teleportation isn't about beaming people or objects from place to place like in Star Trek. Instead, it's a way to transfer information from one particle to another instantaneously. Let's imagine Alice and Bob. Alice wants to send Bob a quantum message. They start with a pair of entangled particles. Alice measures her particle and sends the result to Bob. Bob then uses this information to manipulate his particle. And voila, Bob's particle is now in the same state as Alice's original particle. Essentially, Alice's particle has been teleported to Bob. This process could revolutionize the way we communicate, making our networks faster and more secure. Imagine a world where your internet connection is not just fast, but instantaneous. So, 
Teleportation isn't just science fiction anymore. It's real quantum science. Coming up at number three, the uncertainty principle. This principle, introduced by Werner Heisenberg in the early 20th century, throws a curveball into the world of quantum physics. It tells us that the more precisely we know the position of a subatomic particle, the less precisely we can know its momentum and vice versa. It's not about our inability to measure both accurately, but a fundamental aspect of quantum reality. In other words, it's not about our limitations, but the universe's own inherent fuzziness. This principle is a cornerstone of quantum mechanics, and it defines the limits of what we can know about the quantum world. It's like trying to simultaneously watch a movie and read a book. You can't fully focus on both at the same time. So, in the grand scheme of things, the uncertainty principle reminds us that there are some things even science can't be certain about. At number two, we have quantum field theory, a fascinating concept that marries two of the most profound theories in physics, quantum mechanics and special relativity. It's like a grand cosmic dance where every particle is represented as a state in a gargantuan field that permeates the entire universe. Imagine for a moment the universe as a vast ocean. Each particle, whether it's an electron, a photon, or a quark, is like a wave in this ocean. The intensity of the wave corresponds to the probability of finding the particle in that location. It's a beautifully poetic way to describe the world around us, isn't it? Quantum field theory also handles the creation and annihilation of particles. It's the universe's ultimate magic trick, where particles can pop into and out of existence, all governed by the conservation of energy. And it's all thanks to the mind-bending rules of quantum mechanics and the speed limits set by special relativity. So that's how quantum field theory combines two of the greatest theories in physics. And finally, at number one, the many worlds interpretation. This theory proposed by physicist Hugh Everett in the 1950s stands as one of the most mind-bending ideas in quantum mechanics. It suggests that every time a quantum event happens, the universe splits into multiple parallel universes. In one universe, the event happened one way, and in another, it happened differently. Imagine flipping a coin. According to the many worlds interpretation, when the coin is in the air, the universe splits into two. One where the coin lands heads, and another where it lands tails. Each possibility becomes a reality in its own universe. This interpretation challenges our traditional understanding of reality, suggesting that there could be an infinite number of parallel universes existing side by side. In these universes, different versions of events, and even of ourselves, could exist. So, there could be countless universes out there each with a different version of you. Well, there you have it. 10 mind-bending facts about quantum physics. We've delved into the quantum quandary, exploring the perplexing nature of this fascinating field. We've looked at the mind-boggling concept of quantum superposition, where particles can be in multiple places at once. We ventured into the realm of quantum entanglement, where particles can be instantly connected, no matter the distance. We've tunneled through barriers with quantum tunneling and examined the dual nature of particles and waves in wave-particle duality. We've also faced the collapse of quantum states in quantum decoherence and glimpsed the future of technology with quantum computing. We've teleported with quantum teleportation, wrestled with the uncertainty principle, 
and delved into the fabric of reality with quantum field theory. Finally, we've considered the possibility of parallel universes in the many worlds interpretation. Remember, the quantum world is as mysterious as it is fascinating. So keep exploring and keep asking questions. Until next time, stay curious.